Hello everybody and welcome back to number 15 Tales Plays The Forest of Drizzling Rain In the last part it's I, I don't remember it's been so long since I've recorded Kanasaki I forgot what the run button is I know we had a run button Oh shit So yeah Finally I come back to this game I haven't recorded this game like for like two weeks that's quite worrisome, even if that's so. I can't just allow this village to degenerate more than this. Hmm? A person from the village, however, he is quite an unpleasant government official. Honestly, you see there are no visitors to this place, right? I think there's no meaning to keep this here. You would understand that the most right... That is that this place is of no access to the village. In order to develop this village we need to clear up the mountain. The existence of this museum poses a little problem for that. Oh no. The past is different from now. There have been no children going missing in recent years so don't you think it's behind the times to be bound by the old? This Kotori Obeik and Ogami-san reek of being bogus tales. Well, what? It's because you're like that that people don't come close to this place. What? A memo? Huh? Really, since it's like that when talking with you. You don't seem very accommodating to our negotiations, but in the village council we just made a resolution to demolish this place. This is no place to spread around something unscientific. It makes things seem too creepy, so even if you can't find the next job, I don't know. Well, there's a bigger problem for you than that, right? Uh, you aren't you, the young lady from Zakuma-san's place. You can't just do that, coming in here and staying around like that. So Sakuma-san, what also support this proposal to? Go die, you raccoon, like old man. Well, I was weird. What is that? What a rude girl. This time I'll tell a complaint to that family. But I think you're the one that's being rude. What? You? A face I've never seen before. Um, I was the owner of this museum. I am the grandchild of Kanasaki Keichiro. Grandchild? A relative of Kanasaki? Yes, I am. As long as I am a relative, I have to say on the rights to this museum. So please don't just say whatever you please. A young girl like you is the inheritor. Ha ha ha. Please give it up. From what I see, you're a city kid, right? Please give this estate to the village. It is beyond your powers. Of course, there is some outlook on a purchase. Mm, please leave. Really now? Because of this, what kind of coward? Things like that annoying legend is just crap. And for you to not understand that, I will be leaving for today. guy walks weird. I'm sorry for just saying things on my own. It wasn't my true intention, so don't worry, Suga-san. However, like Sakuma-chan, I just somehow got really angry. This name is so hard for me to keep track of. Hmm? Another note. Thank you. Ah. Yes, don't worry. Dinner? Shall we eat? Yes, let's eat. It's weird. They're all weird. Everyone's weird. Well, that's stupid. Ah. So Gus Chan's cooking had the taste of ashes. But I was able to eat everything. Next time I'll make something for him. Seriously, they have... They eat in by the restroom. That's right, the plate. Took the plate off the table. 
Thanks for the good meal. Whoa. Whoa. Why is that this feels so nostalgic? Ah, it's nothing. No, um, just for that suga san to... What's that? Who's knocking? suga -kun, are you there? It's me, Mochisuki. Officer Mochisuki? Oh, it's a cop guy. Please open. It's Sakuma there. Oh, no. Well, I haven't even gone half the episode. It's just pure text. And so Sakuma has still not come home, it seems. It looks like the rain will continue this evening. And like this, it would, of course, be quite dangerous. But that's right. She did once go outside of here. Sugakun. Excuse me, but we would like to search around and in the mansion. So could you lend me the keys? What's that sound? Sorry about this. If it would be okay with you guys, I'd like for you all to also help. If anything happens, report it to me. We're gonna be in this game for a while. When are we gonna stop doing watching cutscenes? I also need to search. Don't do anything. No, I'll search because I'm worried. You can't. But you can't expect me to do that. Then don't go in the forest. Hmm? I think I can do that. A protective charm. Obtain necklace. This is the necklace from that day, speaking of which. The night glowstone is a protective charm in this village, isn't it? Thank you. Oh no, we're gonna be in here for a while. I just know it. Look at this. We're already seven minutes and I haven't gotten able to do anything. So I leap. Can't just go out as I please. So what now? I go follow the cop? I'll follow cop guy a bit. There's too much rain sound. Uh... Sure, why not? Let's go in here. Oh, uh, cutscene. Ah! Found you! What? The noise is so loud here. What was that? Hold on. I need to lower down the volume on my... What was that? That scared me. I'm out of here. Not going in there. You know, I should probably save or something. That was scary. Save. You wanna save here just in case the recording messes up or something? I doubt it will. Oh, it's cop guy. That fellow really, where did she go? If something happens, report it to me. Uh... Okay, let's just go I guess. It's locked. Oh, what? Oh, no, it's this again. No escape. So I guess I just wander around the police? Nope, guess not. What about here? Remember the promise? I'm scared. Ah! Oh no, it's just on this. What? A power outage. Oh, guess we're gonna have to end that off here, folks, because we're about to go past the 10 minute mark. Man, we did barely anything. Oh, I did get two jump scares, sort of. One jump scare for sure, but not the other one. So I guess I'll have to see you all in the next episode in the Forest of Drizzling Rain. Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe to stay up to date with this game, and whatever else I might be doing, I probably might not be doing much with this, or like, at the moment. So yeah, see you guys next time. Bye.